Hello, I'm Cole Powell, award-winning singer-songwriter from Random Mind Records. If you enjoy what you hear, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and click the bell for notifications. Also, if you'd like the ability to help us choose what content to react to on the channel, as well as early access to reaction videos, consider supporting us on Patreon for $1 a month. The link's in the description. We also have $2 and $3 tiers that would give you access to exclusive content such as full-length album reactions, as well as full-length music-related television episode reactions. Well, now that Okay, so I usually don't do an intro about the songs. I used to do that in the early videos. If you've been following the channel since we launched last year, you'd know that. I don't know whether you remember or not. But with this one, it's a little bit different for us. This song is actually from a Mississippi independent artist. She's 14 years old. I don't think she's turned 15 yet. I think she's 14. And I actually got to hear a snippet of this in demo form a couple of years ago. She wrote this when she was 12. And when I heard the demo snippet of this, I was absolutely blown away. I heard a couple of other tracks, too, that she had done, and I was just absolutely blown away. So I'm really, really pumped to get in here and listen to see the final production on this. Let's take a listen. A young shield, real strong, protects my heart with the vibrating song. Raging flames, hot eyes, the sun. Sounds like a live stream, not synthesized, very nice. Yeah, that's a real violin, nice. That's a good stopping point right there before we get into the second verse here. If you're new to the channel, we pause periodically. I've gone over why we do that, multiple videos, multiple comments. There's a video I did talking about fair use. should be in the description if you want to check that out for more information on that. If you're looking to see the original video, there should be a link to that description as well. So they've been working on getting her songs recorded for the last couple of years. They started releasing singles last year. Her first single called Obvious was a more of a punk rock track, kind of remind me a bit of Avril Lavigne. This song, completely different vibe. This is like a 2000s pop rock ballad, which is right up my alley. If you if you watch all my videos, you've probably heard me say that I love that genre before. This song has gotten 80,000 streams on Spotify, which is absolutely phenomenal. I think it was released in February. It's absolutely phenomenal for a 14-year-old independent Mississippi artist to get those kinds of numbers on Spotify with an original song that she wrote when she was 12. So really impressive stuff here. All right, so let's look at the first verse here. Iron shield real strong protects my heart. The vibrating song, raging flames, high as the sun, closing on everyone. I won't die. My heart is protected by an iron shield. But what is that shield? You can have multiple different interpretations here. This could be interpreted as maybe a shield around your heart from a Christian religious perspective. And I know it's got the album artwork has a cross. So I'm leaning towards that, be it at least part of the interpretation of the lyrics. Yeah, again, this girl wrote this when she was 12 years old. I, I'm, I'm really digging it. Let's get back to it. Strong as gold Never gets older and old Yeah, Ooh, oh. The guitar right there.
Okay, we're going to the bridge here. Nice turnaround. I like that. Great production on this too. Okay, gotta switch up the drum roll here. Yeah, yeah, that was, I thoroughly enjoyed that. All right, so we had a little trouble in the editing room on the end of the video, the wrap-up, the summary of, of my thoughts. So I'm coming back and refilming that and tr just try to repeat what I said. Unfortunately, it's not the live reaction like we usually have, having just come off the list of the song, but I at least went and put on the same shirt I was wearing that day, tried to give some visual continuity. But anyway, the song was great. Thematically, I got a lot of religious overtones here. I I'm hearing themes of faith, hope, strength. There's also this idea of you can kill my body, but not my spirit. And for me personally, like those themes really resonate with me. It's also, again, she wrote this when she was 12 years old. That's some deep thinking stuff. I, I mean, it's, it's really great. You don't get that particularly in modern pop ballads. And that's what this is. It's a it's a pop rock ballad. It's melodically perfect right in that range. The song structure also perfect for a commercial pop track. It's got verse, chorus, verse, chorus, bridge, repeat the chorus twice. And again, to be able to understand commercial song structure at that young of an age and deliver perfectly, it's almost unheard of. And, but there were also some dynamic, like at the end when it went to the drum rolls, like that was unexpected. That's not necessarily something that would have been standard in a normal pop song like this. It was elevated a little bit. Vocally, she had a really strong voice. Again, only 14 years old. And I feel like I've, I've heard other singers that have that similar sound to their voice. And I think as she gets older, she may find something a little bit more distinctive as her voice develops and opens up a little bit more distinctive to separate her from the other singers in that range. But still, very strong. Again, somebody this young, great track, definitely an artist to keep an eye on. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, consider supporting us on Patreon. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And we'll see you soon.